Hi everyone, in this video we are going to learn a loading CSS code and we go, we can use this a basic simple CSS loading code we can use the simple CSS loading code without doing any changing and we can make two different type of CSS loader so in this video I'm going to make you like that and you can learn this so I'm going to directly on my VS code and here's you can see loading text.html I have created a file so here's I have to complete that this this file is here so here I'm typing the CSS loader so the CSS loader is almost typing here and now inside this body section here I will type a class name here I'm typing a loading text the loading text this is the class name here and I have to copy this class name and I am opening here the style file under this body section so here's I'm opening the style file and here's I will type this basic CSS so that is margin 0 that is margin 0 and padding 0 and this here I'm typing the font family font family here sans serif and now I will type here the border box sizing here so that will be the box sizing will be work for the border box that's all text and element how to write it inside this and this everything will be go to the under the box sizing so here's now I will type this class name here and now we will open this style file here so here's I'm typing this first of all position relative so that will be work for this our situation and this why we want to set up this and why we want to make this element the setup here so this position here and now we will type this from the top is I will type this 30 VS it will be vertically top and bottom center here and from the left and right I will type for this left is 40% so it will be left and right from this center it will be goes to there so here now I will type a color and this color will be transparent color so that it will be not effect inside or this loading animation here so here's now I will type this background so here's I will type this background here okay background here I will type a linear gradient color and it will be I will make it the 90 degree left here's 90 degree and I will make this red calci the calci basically used for the calculation property here so here I'm typing this 50% okay 50% plus and here I'm typing this one pixel and then after this color code and open point the array comma here and now I will type here the another color is blue here is blue and zero and then I am going to make this color red will be go to the left side and right blue will be on the right side so under this section here I will type this right and slash calci here here I will type in another calci again here okay C A L C calci here and we will open this calci function this calculation function here so here's I'm going to make this 200% and plus 2 pixel and after this section this the animation will be run to this 100% here okay so after complete this section now we will type if we take this page let's see what is showing there is showing is nothing here so now we have to add here the background clip so here I will type the background clip okay the background clip here so we'll type this background first and then clip 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 and it will be the text because we want to make the animation which should be the text animation here and now we can type here this the hyphen first of all or we can copy this line directly because we are going to add just a webkit element here so click on this the shaped alert and down arrow so the line will be copy inside in the down so now we will type here the hyphen and here we will type this webkit hyphen so it will be this webkit this background it will be for make this the webkit animation here we we'll just make this the webkit this will be for the text webkit it will be go this the color will be left to right side for this text inside this text that's why we are using this webkit here so now we will type here the animation property here so I'm typing animation here so I'm typing this loading the animation property name is loading here 
and 2 second this in transition delay here and I will type for this in finite and the step is I will type the step is you can type this step as 5 ok now we will go to copy this this class name here and under this section under this style file section here we will open this class name and we will make here this default double clone default and open this style file ok now we will type here the content for because we haven't shown that what element will be show the content will be your definition is that that it will be show that content what you want to show inside your in your skin here so i will type here this content and here this double quotation here some typing loading here some typing this loading okay that's it and here's this is the loading is almost here now if we check this you can see here's a loading is showing but this font is very small so I want to make here this uh, add a font size inside this before I will add a font size I'm adding a font size is 40 pixel okay now if we see that you can see the text is gone big and now it's going there is no animation is still here so now we are going to make this animation for this keyframe so we have type here this the animation property is that and I will type here this at the rate of keyframe and this now I will type here this animation property and open a style file and I'm going to make this animation the red color this red color will be from this left side to right side so here's I'm going to two two is definition defined by the position here and two it's open here and here I will type this background background position will be from the left that I want to show you that this color is going to this left side to right side so here this left here so now if we check this it must be shown the design here you can see here it's going so fast here okay for going so fast now we have to make some delay here inside this okay now we'll add here a font size font weight is blood on this under this loading text class here so we'll type here this font width okay here so we'll type this font width and it will be plot so after this now reload this page and you can see the text is gone blot but there's animation is not working because of this there's no width here it now so under this section here we will type in width here so I'm adding a width that will be perfectly this 100% the width will be fixed that wide of this 100% here so I'm typing here with this 300 pixel and now it must be going to this loading machine animation is completed here you can see the animation is loading in this loading animation is successful here so this using this code it's a simple and it's a simple loading animation so now I will make this another different type of loading animation using this this code and here nothing doing any nothing. I'm going not going to make any sense here so just here I will type a comment here this webkit background clip text here's just I will type this comment content plus slash so now you will see here a different type of loading animation will be shown here you can see it's it's here you can see this different type of loading animation is showing here so here is that and if we comment it uncomment it so here it will be goes to that the content as the loading section here so you can see it's very cool and you can see that it is using very basic this loading code and you can make this simple code you can make a two type of different loading shape so hope you understand this video everything is how to make that and if you like this video please like on this and share this with your friends please subscribe and press the bell icon for all updates thank you so much for watching this video and goodbye